inevitably Old Court, which is the sort of centrepiece of the college, is badly in need of some serious renovation. It's a lot of work to be done. And one of the first things we did was undertake a complete survey of the whole college estate. And that showed us that there were a number of things that were urgent and some of the things that needed to be done in the longer term. And over the past seven years, we've been planning a range of works to Old Court to renew and restore the fabric of the building, to improve the student experience, improve accessibility as well. The new River Room Cafe is going to be magnificent, going to provide a space for undergraduates that they don't currently really have in Old Court. And the access arrangements that we're going to have are going to be spectacular too. The new lift is going to make Old Court, especially this part, the heart of Old Court, the North Range, ex fully accessible for the first time in its history. So what excites me about the new cafe is that the opportunity to create a new space in the centre of Cambridge in the historic fabric of the city is incredibly rare. This is going to be a new space and we're going to use it for the college. We're going to use it to improve the student experience. We're going to use it to improve student access, to encourage kids from schools across the country who come to Clare College to give them the kind of experience and facilities we think they need. We welcome school groups from across the country here on a regular basis. We welcome children, uh, they can be as, as young as 11, up to sixth form. We also welcome their families here. And, uh, and we don't currently have the spaces to do that in the way we'd like to do. And so the new River Room Cafe is gonna give us a really great space to welcome these families to Claire so that they can see Claire, be welcome to Claire, and get to know about the opportunities that are here for them. Clare College has a very inclusive environment and it's also got a very fine, long-standing and well-known tradition for being liberal and inclusive. Many, many hundreds of generations of students have been through here and have done amazing things, although I wasn't a student here. I felt at home from day one. Being in a place like Clare, it's clear that we're just passing through and I think it's the responsibility of our generation to undertake the renewal and the restoration for future generations. At a personal level, the challenge for me is to undertake that in a way that respects the historic fabric of Clare. So at the end of this, I think you won't notice any difference from the outside. It will look the same. Hopefully, internally, there'll be a lot of difference. This is a very exciting project. As far as I know in Cambridge, there's no historic building like this that has had a campaign of this magnitude. Everybody needs to know that we're doing something that hasn't been done before, and that's really exciting. Clare College has been here for nearly 700 years. Hopefully it'll be here for at least another 700 years. And we need, for that reason, for, if for no other, but certainly for that reason, we need to make sure that we can do something with these buildings and with the environment here to make it good for um, the foreseeable future.